The Nerd Girls bring you live from B Luck 2012 in Antwerp, Belgium. This one's Steve McDonough, Art Rediscover, Your Inner Da Vinci, produced by Spike Studio. Okay, next up we have Mr. McDonough. Oh, who's up there? Yeah. Give me two stats. Oh. Okay. Um. You see what my title is there, Art, uh, Rediscover Your Inner Dimension. And what I'd like to challenge everybody here today to rediscover the creative juices that flowed whenever you were very small. Whenever you were two, three years old, your parents would give you a piece of paper, some crayons, and some paints, play doh and you'd make things. And you would revel in the, cre- the act of creation. You enjoyed it, it was great fun. And you would take whatever you made to your mum and dad and say, look at this. And your mum and dad would go, yes, what's that? <laughs> and you would explain it. And while, while you were creating as a child, what, what you were creating was you were exploring your world. You were testing the edges of your experience. There was your house, your family, your friends, your pets. And you do little stick men and you put little stick men holding hands and the sun was shining and that was you exploring your world. And as you get older, you get to sort of five or six and you start to self-censor. You say to yourself, that isn't really like what I wanted to have. And your parents stop putting your pictures on the fridge. And gradually over time, you get less and less and less creative. And I put it to you today, that is not a good thing. Um, I paint reasonably well. Um, <coughs> in the sense that people actually like to take my pictures home and hang them on walls. And, uh, oh yes, Eileen has two. Mm-hmm. And um, the act of creation for me, when I paint, or um, as Kunzi starting as well, I make walking sticks. It's a catharsis moment. It gives me... Uh, at the end of the day, when and I'm sure you're all the same, and you come in and there's steam coming out your ears and you just hate it, the stress and strain. Get down, get yourself a piece of paper, get yourself some paints, and just splash it around. It doesn't matter what it looks like, but it helps. I come home, I put my headphones on, and I start painting. And it gets everything out of my system. And if anybody in here is a developer, it also helps you redefine what you do within the development world. The things you create will become better looking. And if you can make the time, just listening to the two speakers before, it's about making time to do this. And if you do make time to rediscover your inner dimension, and not self-censor yourself. Enjoy it. It will make you a happier person at the end of the day. So if you leave here with nothing else other than the, the desire to go out with a paintbrush or a pen or a pencil and actually create something again, like you were when you were three, for the joy of doing it, I would be a very happy chap. That's all I've got to say. I think I'd be a six minutes. Thank you.